Here's why I think you should support the Electoral College. The Constitution is about limiting government power. One of the most important ways it does that is by separating powers and leaving most of them with the states, a system that has come to be called federalism. The Electoral College is one of the pillars of this system of states. It recognizes states as the fundamental building blocks of our country. And by allowing each state to run its own elections, the Electoral College removes any need for national control over election administration. In other words, presidential appointees don't run presidential elections. Under a national popular vote system, as soon as a dispute arose between different states, people would demand it be solved by a higher power, and election control would inevitably be sucked up into Washington, D.C. To keep power in the states, especially power over elections, we need to keep the Electoral College as it is. More philosophically, though, the Electoral College also helps, at least a little, to put the presidency in its place. The president does not embody the people or represent the people or have any other broad moral authority beyond an ability to persuade from the bully pulpit. Really, the president's a hired hand put in place to execute the laws as passed by Congress. The Electoral College helps limit the president's ability to make overreaching claims about executive power. As part of our original Constitution, something Alexander Hamilton described as excellent, and that even the anti-federalists conceded was pretty good, we should preserve and protect the Electoral College. I'm Trent England. Thanks for watching.